Today I'm going to teach you how to align your laser using the reverse align method. The secret to this method is to use the laser align tool. This tool shoots a red beam from the head of the laser back to the laser tube. This tool enables us to see the beam path so we can align the laser with ease. The first step is removing the nozzle and the air assist and screwing in the laser alignment tool. The laser alignment tool shines a red beam directly at mirror 3 on the laser head. Now you can mess with the control pots on mirror 3 to see how each control affects the beam path. The goal is to center the red dot on mirror number two along every point of the laser head axis. Make sure the red beam stays centered from mirror number three to mirror number two along the whole laser bed. Now that we have our laser beam centered on mirror number two, it's time to repeat this process and center the beam on mirror number one. It's always best at either axis to start at the farthest point and align as you're moving closer. With a little practice, you should be able to learn these controls and center the mirrors pretty easily. Once the beam is centered along the entire axis on mirror 1, the next step is to shine the red dot directly in the output of your laser tube. Make sure the center of your entire laser tube is in line with the center of laser mirror number 1. Often at this point I go back and check all the alignments to make sure everything is good. I also make any final adjustments to the laser tube to ensure complete alignment. Okay now it's time to remove the laser alignment tool and replace the nozzle and air assist. Okay, now you're ready for a test fire. You could start with a small pulse and move your way up into an actual project. You could try other methods, but reverse laser alignment is the easiest way I've found to align my laser cutter and engraver. I have also included a complete blog that's linked in the comments with more information on how to align your laser cutter and engraver. Follow and subscribe all my social medias to learn more about my laser cutter and my artwork. Be sure to ask any questions that you have in the comments and forward this video to all your laser cutter friends.